Welcome to The Real Deal, and today we're gonna discuss what record low housing inventory means for you. The real estate market is expected to do very well in 2021, with mortgage rates that are hovering at historic lows and forecasted by experts to remain favorable throughout the year. One challenge to the housing industry, however, is the lack of homes for sale today. Last week, the National Association of Realtors released their existing home sales report, which shows that the inventory of homes for sale is currently at an all-time low. The report explains, quote, housing inventory at the end of December totaled 1.07 million units, down 16.4% from November and down 23% from one year ago. Unsold inventory sits at an all-time low 1.9 months supply at the current sales pace down 2.3 months in November and down from three month figure recorded in December 2019. The National Association of Realtors first began tracking the single family home supply in 1982. What does this mean for you? If you're a buyer, be patient. During your home search, it may take time to find a home you love. Once you do, however, be ready to move forward quickly, get pre-approved for a mortgage, be prepared to make a competitive offer from the start, and know that a shortage in the inventory could mean you'll enter a bidding war. Calculate just how far you're willing to go to secure the home and lean on your real estate professional as an expert guide along the way. The good news is more inventory is likely headed to the market soon. Lawrence Young, chief economist at NAR, notes, quote, to their credit, home builders and construction companies have increased efforts to build with housing starts hitting in the annual rate of near 1.7 million in December, with more focus on single family homes. However, it will take vigorous new construction in 2021 and in 2022 to adequately furnish the market to properly meet the demand. If you're a seller, realize that in some ways you're in the driver's seat. When there's a shortage of an item at the same time there's a strong demand for it, the seller is in a good position to negotiate with the best possible terms. Whether it's the price, moving date, possible repairs or anything else, you'll be able to request more from the potential purchaser at a time like this. Especially if you have multiple interested buyers, don't be unreasonable, but understand you probably have the upper hand. Here's the bottom line. The housing market will remain strong throughout 2021. Know what that means for you, whether you're buying, selling or doing both. That's all we've got time for today on this episode. So if you're watching on YouTube, give me a thumbs up, a like on Facebook and a heart on Instagram. Please don't forget to subscribe to my channel. It would mean the world to me. Again, be safe and well out there. We'll see you next week.